Hey y'all, and welcome to the Birmingham Real Estate Market Update. This is the 55th edition of this show, uh, which started in the depths of the coronavirus and has carried us through the shutdown, the recovery, now the vaccination period, as we really start to open up and life starts to return to normal. Um, we're continuing to show you what's happening in the Birmingham real estate market each week. And there's uh, a lot of activity. There's tons of demand and very little supply as, uh, as you'll see today. So we look at the stats week by week and we'll get to that in just a second. There's one uh, economic incentive kind of reminder that I wanted to put in here that uh, one of y'all who watched the show reminded me of, we did a lot of work with the stimulus when that was big and uh, there may be more coming out. There's a couple things that are in the works, but uh, I'll keep you updated on that as well. And uh, I'm doing a webinar on getting started as a real estate agent on 528, that's next Friday. Um, I am a real estate broker at EXP Realty here in Birmingham. I mentor new agents and uh, I've been an agent for four years and closed over 200 transactions. So on that webinar, I'll um, share some things that I've learned about the brokerage business. And you can register for that at robdrum.us slash webinar. So for this week, we had 497 closings that compares to the same week the previous year at 456. So we're at a slightly faster pace, and that's not necessarily surprising because we were still coming out of a, a real dark period as far as activity uh, in the market, a real slowdown. So um, we're running ahead of that pace. Uh, last week, again, we were, we were running significantly ahead of the pace last week, and I think we kind of normalized as we went through the summer, for the most part, financing markets normalized, uh, the appetite for uh, homes kind of normalized, people got back out and about through the summer of last year, so I think this will kind of fall in line uh, as we get deeper into the summer. On the inventory side, uh, really not a whole lot of relief. Numbers are pretty similar to last week. We had uh, just over 1,800 available listings. That continues <clears throat> continues this week. And uh, let's see, I don't have any coming active today, but I've got a, a handful coming active uh, next week. So be on the look for those. Some of them are flip projects uh, or homes that um, you may be interested in as a purchase to live in. So keep an eye on those. Um, we've got them in Crestwood, Hueytown, and uh, Centerpoint. Um, so the contingent pending listings, again, pretty much right in line. So kind of more of the same as far as the uh, Birmingham stats for this week. And we will stay tuned in to see uh, what happens as we continue to recover and continue to work our way through this uh, tight market. As a reminder, my grandmother watches this show and she uh, is a great entrepreneur and she got a PPP loan for her business during the shutdown. Uh, it was a tough you know, struggle for her business like so many people. And um, she wanted me to remind everyone that the PPP loans are eligible to be forgiven. Now is the time to do it. You should be, by now you should be good to go. You wanna be sure you talk to your banker. A lot of y'all used uh, the banker that I used to, uh, to do your loans. So be sure to get those forgiveness forms in, get your loans forgiven. Uh, you don't wanna to forget to do that because it is uh, essentially turns out to be a grant of, of money stimulus to your business. So. Thank you for that reminder, Mana. Um, and again, thank you all for watching. Uh, I am doing a webinar at the end of the month. If you're interested in getting started as a real estate agent, hopefully I can give you some tips and tricks and guide you in the right direction. Uh, you can sign up for that at robdrum.us slash webinar. 
uh, I'd love it if you all would subscribe to this channel. We've got a couple other things in the works. We've got uh, business-wise some really exciting things happening uh, in the next couple months. So stay tuned and uh, we will be in touch. I'll see you next week for the um, Birmingham Real Estate Investor Roundup and y'all have a great weekend.